What is going on YouTube? It's TCG Jake here. Welcome to another video. Today we are going to be opening up a Breakpoint Blister Pack and a Star Wars Mandalorian Baby Yoda the Child, whatever you want to call it. Blaster Box I believe is what it's called. But before that I've got some special to give away for y'all. This Team Up pre-release Charizard is my next giveaway. If you want to win that, the first thing you have to do is subscribe to my channel and then I will let you know how to win at the end. Let's get into the video. So I'm just gonna start with a few things. Uh, I'm not gonna open all of this crap today, but I found these Toon Chaos uh, blister booster packs or whatever for Yu-Gi-Oh at Target. So I grabbed those because of nostalgia reasons. Uh, basically the word Toon, um, if you remember Toon cards from Yu-Gi-Oh. This thing that's probably gonna end up on my eBay store. I got these two Tapu Koko tins which are either going to be opened on the channel or put up on my store. I haven't decided yet. If you're interested in those, let me know. And then I found a bunch of Bakugan for $1.50 at a Walmart a few cities away. So those are going to end up on my store. And then these Dragon Ball booster packs that I found also at Target. The only reason I even picked those up was because somebody told me about how cool the like secret cards are. And I looked them up and they are very awesome looking. Um, and then this last dumb thing, which honestly, I only bought this because one, I'm pretty dumb, like I've said before, and two, everyone else is pretty dumb. So we're gonna see if uh, we can actually sell this truck, this Tesla truck that we bought for more. So we're gonna see how dumb people really are. And in other news, I bought my first Tesla. This is the Journey of the Child 2020 trading cards from Star Wars The Mandalorian. And basically, I'm not gonna read all of it, but what we're gonna be looking for is illustrated card parallels, and then the steel card, I guess, which is one out of 8,559, which are approximately close to the same odds of finding a shiny Pokemon, I believe, in gens one through five, and after that, it changed. And then we'll move on to this Breakpoint Blister Pack, which, if y'all know Breakpoint, Red Gyarados, pretty much the card we're looking for. I actually recently just sold one, but we are gonna start with this Star Wars box and go from there. I was smart enough to actually grab my scissors. Hopefully I didn't stab anything super special. None of these cards I believe are worth hardly anything. And then uh, on top of that, I just thought I'd let y'all know I did sell my Shining Charizard from CGC for 1,050, shipped it out today, which that's a little less than I would have wanted for it. But at the end of the day, it is something that I wanted to try with CGC. I do think that would get a PSA 10, so whoever bought it is most likely gonna bust it out of there and send it to PSA. And part of the reason I know that is because I checked out their eBay page and they have a lot of PSA cards for sale. As far as that goes, I sold that Shadowless Charizard too. I'm just waiting on the person to pay. Um, that one I sold for $1,500. And then I have listed my, my SV Black Label Hidden Fates Umbreon. And I was gonna originally auction it off, but I didn't do that. I decided to list it for 5,000. I know that's probably really high, but that's what I figured I'd take for it. And then I also listed my Sylveon for, I think, 2,000. I'm not so sure what I want on that, but 2,000 seemed what I wanted. And if nobody wants to pay that, that's fine. I've got it best offer on there. Uh, other than that, I figured if I sell them, I'd just buy new ones and not grade them or possibly grade them. There's just no way those can be held at that value for that long or over a thousand. I know currently that people would pay over, over a thousand because I have gotten offers for them. So that's the only reason I know that. So I believe this comes with the full, here we'll look at the picture, the full 32 card set, Enter the Child. So I believe that's the first time you see him in the show. An unexpected bounty, which I believe is like the end of the show or like the end of the first episode, along for the ride, taking aim with the Mandalorian. Actually, that one's the meme, isn't it? Witness to the Mudhorn fight. It's not a toy. So there are blue Imperial drop off and orange parallels and other type of parallels giving in to the child. Don't touch that. Not staying put. I love how these are all baby Yodas. Breaking up the fight into the village, saying goodbye an unexpected passenger. Really, these are just like, it's funny because like, if you really think about it, because Baby Yoda is, I don't think he's a puppet, he's CGI, isn't he? A friendly face, 
That means these are literally just screenshots. A temporary caretaker, the child revealed, unwise taunts. I told you that was a bad idea. Some of these names are funny. Into the care of Quill. I think that's what it is. I don't remember his name. I remember the guy though. Meeting the child. I'll try not to spoil it too much for those of you who haven't seen it, but I'm assuming you have. Running toward the Razor Crest, which is the Mandalorian's awesome looking ship. Speeder bike delight. Looking up. Yes, he surely is looking up. Blasting off with the Phoenix. And we've got a green parallel. An unexpected bounty. So the first one. Oh, the child. The force is strong with this little one. Is this a sketch card or are these different? Mandalorian. Collect all the illustrated art cards. Five of five. I wonder. We've got another one it looks like. I don't know how these all work. Collect all of the illustrated art cards, one of five. I'm, does it come with all of them? I don't think so. Two of five, maybe it does come with all of them. There was one green parallel, so that was cool. These are really cool. Three of five. But they're not, they're not artist sketch cards. Four of five and five of five. Our extra um, was actually this green parallel card. And y'all know that since we are a Pokemon channel, I will throw prices up there, by the way, uh, of these cards, if they're anything, which they're probably not. Uh, we got to open break point and do some shiny hunting. I don't know any of the other cards in break point that I want. I believe there is the Gyarados EX secret rare that is, it has like a Manaphy and a gold border and it's shiny. I think that there is also a Mega Gyarados Shiny EX that is in this set too. Uh, here is the awesome pin. I don't like Red Gyarados just because it's around all the time, but I, I have to admit that Secret Rare Gyarados in this set is pretty dope looking. We'll start with Luxray, which I believe is a Luxray break on the front. So we can get break cards. Um, I'm not sure of the other full art EXs, if there are any or other EXs that are in this set. Here is your code. Good luck with your online polls. Not that this set means anything online anymore, but good luck anyways. Trying not to see the back. Fighting Fury Belt, Maw Wile, Special Splash Energy, Shelder, Cricketot, Rattata, Froakie, Electabuzz, Reverse Hollow Max Potion, and a regular rare shift tree. I don't know if this one has a regular hollow too, but that would be awesome because this card is pretty lit. That is pretty sick art in the background. Oh, I think Mega Scizor is one of the other full arts in here. Should do a shiny Mega Scizor. Actually, there's a lot of Megas we haven't gotten shinies of, which I would love to see someday. I'm sorry I keep flipping your guys' codes upside down. Uh, they just keep coming out that way and it's just, I'm just gonna leave them like that. Special Splash Energy, Misty's Determination, Pharaoh Seed, Electabuzz, Froki, Patel, Skrelp, Reverse Hollow Trubbish, the Trash Bag, and a regular rare Zeb Strika. We've got one more Breakpoint Booster Pack for the day. We're gonna do some Last Pack Magic. I just flipped it into the sky and see what we have in our final pack. So let's go Red Gyarados. I actually want, our card was backwards this time, that's fine. I actually want the regular, not the Mega, just cause the secret rare for that is so much cooler. It really is. Hopefully we've got some last pack magic here. Mawile, Scizor Spirit Link, Gyarados Spirit Link, come on Gyarados. Corsola, Froki, Pharaoh Seed, Electabuzz, Staryu, Reverse Hollow Max Elixir, and a Ho-Oh Full Art EX. That is dope. That is something that I'll take any day, all day long. Welcome to the family, Ho-Oh. Very cool. Glad I didn't try to sell that blister because I was thinking about it. There's a dent right in the top up there. Otherwise, we've got a pretty solid condition card in a few corners. My assumption for that, with it being pretty much on center too, is that this would get a PSA 9 just because of those dents. Uh, I'm making sure that's not a fuzz and it's not, but it's still really awesome. Thank you all for stopping by. I hope y'all enjoyed 
that video. Let me know what you want to see opened next. I'm probably going to shoot another video for tomorrow here shortly, just so I have two ready to go. Sorry I haven't been getting them up on the scheduled 2.15 time. Anyways, thanks for watching. Bye now.